Let's take a quick look back on the first three months of the year. Regular viewers will know that instead of talking about profits and return on equity, I like to talk about customers and how we help them to stay a step ahead. So I'm really pleased that more than 400,000 additional people chose for ING this past quarter. We also boosted our primary relationships by 170,000. Thanks in a large part to our challenger markets like Australia and Germany. We're attracting people there and elsewhere with our empowering experience, like ING Global Index Portfolios, our low cost and easy to use investment solution. Please check ING.com for more on that and other innovative offerings like PayVision. People also come to us because of our commitment to sustainability and a low carbon and self-reliant society. We've just set ambitious targets for responsible finance with the aim that by 2022 we'll have doubled our funding to organizations that positively impact society and environment and help combat climate change. We also support others securing sustainable finance like the eight green bonds we help place and the 500 million US dollar loan for Asian agribusiness Olam International, where ING was appointed sustainability coordinator. So it's been another good quarter, and I'd like to thank everyone who puts their trust in ING. You're the reason why we try to get better every day.